All right. Well, Kenny, I'm going to plug you now uh, while uh, these blindfolded. The album what? is The Gift. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. What did you say? <laughs> you know, I heard that. you know something. You know something. You know, Conan. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. You know something. You, know, uh, you need to know something. <laughs> there is a line you can cross with me. That may be it. You will not plug me while I'm blindfolded. <laughs> You know, what's, you know what's scary? I looked forward to coming here tonight, too. I know you did. Oh. The album is the gift. This is our last show, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. And the Family Channel concert special, Kenny Rogers, The Gift, premieres December 4th at 9. Never mind. <laughs> That's what I meant! <laughs> it's their fault. Any Italian-Americans and non-Italians, Bolognese. May I interrupt you for a second? Yes. You. Continue. I have every confidence that you will be personally enriched by this experience. Uh, by doing this together, both for us as friends and colleagues, uh, as a student do you, consider, of, do you consider us friends? I do. <laughs> I have some pictures from my various... I, you know, I was just trying to post a photo for the fans, but there was a reflection in the sunglasses of my computer screen, and I, didn't, I wasn't aware of that when it posted, and it was quite embarrassing. Uh, I don't know if you can see. I can't really see. Maybe you tell us what it is. I mean, it's an old man uh, who's naked with an erect penis <laughs> on my computer screen. And you know, this is private stuff that I'm looking at, whatever, you know. <laughs> I'm like doing it, and it's just one of those unfortunate accidents, you know, where, you know, there's a reflection. Why are you wearing your sunglasses when you're looking at male pornography? I, you know, what I do in my own time is what I do. It's like, you know. okay. But you also, you did look very cool. Yeah. I, I mean, yeah. I was yeah. trying to look cool. I right. had an unfortunate reflection. Right, right. Okay, now, Instagram made you take that down, okay? They took it down. They took yeah. it down. Now, you came back with another picture. Uh, this is you holding a knife. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on here, Nathan? I mean, again, like, you know, I just didn't know that there was a reflection of my computer screen in the photo. And... You know, I like this particular image, and I look at it sometimes, and okay. I just didn't... While you're eating? You're e eating food. It was just one of those accents that you don't realize until you post it, and then you're like, oh, that's embarrassing. Okay, next one. Rear view mirror. I mean... <laughs> I actually, How could that even happen? I, I want to walk over to the monitor and look up closer and see it, but... I'll... I'll freeze frame it at home. Oh, my God. It's like a private thing that happens to accidentally. <laughs> one you... of my ex-wives yep. died, you know, that it was very sad because it was the wrong one. <laughs> when I was young, there was a fella uh, by, went by the name of uh, Jacques de Gautier. And he was from uh, Tamiskaming, Quebec. <laughs> and Jacques de Gautier, he was a fella that really thought. And he was smart, you know. He was our hope, I guess. And he, uh, he was, uh, while I was scrambling to get out of high school, <laughs> Jacques Zagatino had already... I think he just changed his last name. <laughs> Well, you know, a man grows. He, he, uh... <laughs> so you would yeah. wait. So you would use the tapes that they sent you. Right. The the uh, these Christian tapes. Yes. You would use those tapes and you would tape over them. Actual school, I would tape. I would, well, I'd leave ten minutes of the real class at the front of the tape. Are you? 
every month you have to send the tapes back to Christian Video Academy. Right. Yes. And Christian Video Academy does not watch the tapes back for quality control. They just blindly send them to other homeschool students. Which means, like, some homeschool student would be sitting through, like, a Christian science class where they're like, you know, photosynthesis is caused by the devil. (laughs) That video cuts out, and then on comes, like, the FedEx Pope. Or the masturbating bear. Masturbating bear, whatever terrible thing you were doing. Now, is this true? You brought, you you have an example, and this is real. So enough students had complained about me recording over these videos that Christian Video Academy actually launches an internal investigation. They trace the tapes back to our address. They send my mom a very angry letter in all caps that says, like, you've damaged our curriculum. It's been recorded over by a program that is, quote, not in line with our core Christian values. (laughs) And along with the letter, they send my mom an example tape back. But this is from uh, Mrs. Robinson's... uh, science class, and uh, so before it cuts out, you'll see a little bit of her class. And one thing that was interesting about Mrs. Robinson is she would do, like, pretty mundane, hands-on science experiments. Right. But she would treat them all like she had just done witchcraft (laughs) for us. Like, she would heat up water and be like, and that's how vapor's made. Yeah. Right? So we'll see a little bit of her class before it cuts out okay. with a program that is not in line. Let's with the take a look at uh, this uh, tape uh, that got you in a lot of trouble. Let's take a look. Here we go. One, two, three, and in. <laughs> How about? No one lights up like Mr. Martin Short. You come out there and that light hits you. Well, I mean, it's awfully appreciated. Yeah. <laughs> and I didn't even know that there was an audience. I'd heard the monologue, but, you know... <laughs> <laughs> it is. It does get quiet at times. Sometimes, yes. in a marriage, yes. when uh, the husband makes a mistake, the woman will make him pay for a long time. Is that something you think is going to happen? Oh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> Are you going to make Ozzy pay? Oh, big time. Yes. Yeah. It's like he has to go downstairs for three hours every day. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> you say you like sex. Ah. on that. I came into my son's bedroom the other night, and he looked, uh, he looked really sad. I said, what's the matter, buddy? Because I don't know his name. I'm never home. <laughs> he said, uh, can I be honest with you? Uh-huh. I said, yeah. I wish you would stop lying, if that's what you're saying. <laughs> he said, well, I was just thinking, I'm 10 now, and you're 63. When I'm 20, you're going to be 73. When I'm 30, you're going to be 83. He said, you're not going to be around for a lot of my life, are you? I said, buddy, buddy, buddy. What's his name? Yeah. I said, I'm going to be around for a long time. It's your mother you have to worry about. She's not going to want to hang around with an old fart like me eventually. Yeah. You yeah. know what? Yeah. He goes, no, dad. I'm, uh, apparently he doesn't know my name either. Yeah. Dad. <laughs> it's his dad stuff. He said, I'm serious. There's kids in my class in fifth grade. I said, you're in fifth grade? He goes, yeah. The parent, their parents are like in their 30s, their early 30s. I said, that doesn't mean anything. There's no guarantee. It doesn't mean a thing. Well, you know, who, who says they're not going to die in a fiery car crash tomorrow? You know, or a murder-suicide? You don't know. <laughs> and who says you're going to outlive me? <laughs> you don't know that. I mean, who's to say a murdering clown's not going to come in your bedroom tonight <laughs> and smother you? with a balloon animal. You don't, you don't know that. You could die in a dentist chair. That's happened before. Anyway, I kissed him on the forehead. I said, you get a good night's sleep. We'll talk about this. <laughs> That's the kind of father I am. Right. 
good. You know, the budget cuts have hit our lighting department particularly hard. Uh, we, we, we no longer can afford to repair our broken light fixtures, which is a problem because that's going to be, um, uh, it's going to fall any time now because that's how we rehearsed it. Someone pulls on it. <laughs> I just thought of another budget cut, Nick. The league's gonna be fine. Like, what they would have to do, to, I was talking to my buddy the other day, like, what they would have to do to get me to stop watching. You know, like- you love football, you yeah, watch football. Yeah, the, the commissioner could literally punt a baby across his <laughs> office <laughs> with his wingtips on. I'm still gonna watch on Sunday. I don't condone the man's actions, <laughs> but it's football. I have to watch it. This is all I have. Hey, Germany is very good at soccer. Oh, we are good. Yeah, you're very good at that. What do you think if the U.S. soccer team uh, had less success? It is very sad. It is like if you go to the bakery and you're like, I will have eight cupcakes, and then you receive a salad. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait a minute. <laughs> I was in Scandinavia, so I, I told them they were descended from Vikings, um, rapists, mainly. <laughs> you yeah. told them that... You've got to start off with your best stuff. Yeah. Um, <laughs> so, so you're there in front of all these people, yeah. you're saying you're all descended from Vikings yeah. who are... I said I, I forgave them for all the raping and pillaging, but... <laughs> How'd that go over? It was good. They, they, I mean, they admitted that the pillaging was secondary to the raping. That's what they... <laughs> That's what they came over for. <laughs> They've got the raping hats on, you know. That's the, that Wait, is, the thing with the horns you're calling that? that you'd, if, if a Viking's getting off a boat and he's running towards you, there's only one thing on his mind if he's wearing that hat. Okay. Is, so, yeah. so you would talk about yeah. them and these, what you yeah. would call, in your words, this, well, this raping hat. I just hat. didn't know how they got away, because obviously it was only the men that went on the lot. They came from, like, Norway and Sweden, they came and... They raped all over Europe. They um, <laughs> raped in, everywhere. Um, and um, I, was just, I just considered that, that guy, you know, saying to his wife, going, I'm, I'm off for a... going to see some of the rest of Europe. All right, yeah, have a nice time. What, why are you taking your raping hat? <laughs> <laughs> no reason, no reason. We'll just leave it here. Well, the other guys are taking theirs. <laughs> you know. So yeah. <laughs> <laughs>